G'day, Hayden here at Pacific Toyota giving you the personalized high definition virtual tour on our Toyota Hilux SR5 dual cab ute. Uh, so basically what I'm gonna do is just show you through the entire car. So we're gonna kick things off by uh, starting in the engine bay. Um, then we'll work our way through all the paint and panel in the vehicle. Um, and then work our way into the interior, going through all the instrumentals, all the service history and all the, um, I guess the interior condition. So we'll kick things off. We'll uh, pop the bonnet here, make sure there's an engine, which there is. So we have a 2.8 litre turbo diesel engine, and as you can see, under the hood, nice and tidy, all nice and clean, firewalls all intact, all the original stickers uh, on the bonnet there. Close that one down. Let's give you a look up the front of the bonnet. And as you can see, there is no visible dents in the bonnet. Paintwork wise, it is pretty much immaculate, apart from a little stone chip just here. It's just a bit of bug splatter. Same with that. Bug splatter there. So realistically, there's only really one, yeah, one stone chip on the bonnet, which is just that one there. Um, well, on the front bar, we got a bit of a mark here and also one just here. So we do have your front facing sensors through the front as well. through the front with the uh the bar there all really tidy a little bit of a scuff mark now that should just come out with a bit of cut and polish to be honest um it's not through the paint or anything like that which is good down the uh driver's side here as you can see no visible dents in any of the panel work factory alloy wheels um wrapped in a dunlop uh, highway terrain tire and as you can see there's heaps of tread left on those paint work wise through here all nice and tidy Nothing to really report so far. Slight little mark just there. Through to the rear of the, uh, the tray and tub. Reversing sensors, reversing camera. The actual tub itself looks like brand new to be honest. There's a couple of little marks on it, but nothing uh, nothing major. Nice and clean through there. And then popping down the passenger side this time. Again, all in fantastic condition as well. No visible dents. Paintwork wise through here. Again, all in really good condition. I'm just gonna dive across like this car. Obviously, factory running boards along the base there. And the paintwork through here is in fantastic condition as well. All right. Just unlock the car. So, in the back here, we do have uh, factory rubber floor mats, air conditioning vents, tow bars in the back there. And all the seats are all in perfect condition as well. So there's no rips or stains or tears or anything like that, which is awesome. Just coming across, we'll jump into the driver's seat. Now the vehicle does come with two remote keys and then two auxiliary keys as well. We do have passive entry for the door at the front here. Other floor mats again, all nice and tidy. car over so inside obviously we do have the upgraded dash um, no warning lights on that dash either which is pleasing to see uh, 15,786 k's on the clock um, stereo and Bluetooth controls just here cruise control center screen controls and then you also do have your lane departure and radar cruise down here push button start your idle up parking sensors and manual DPF burn off button all your window controls are just over here. Um, now they are a power folding side mirror as well. Uh, inside our dash, you can see the little traffic sign up there. Um, so that basically tells you what speed zone you're in. So there's sort of takes the guesswork out of out of it for you. Um, so uh, it's a bit of a, I guess, a bit of a game changer. Um, if you're unsure on what speed zone you're in, it'll it'll tell you. Um, over into your infotainment system. Now this is fitted out with satellite navigation as standard. 
obviously all your radio controls, Bluetooth controls, all that sort of stuff. So we'll just go to a station here. So as you can hear there, all the speakers are working nicely. There's no distortion. Um, we'll go to setup and you can see here, we do have your projection settings, which is your Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. Um, backup camera down here, dual zone climate control settings, all your full driving options. Um, two 12 auxiliary ports, you've got your IMT. Um, you've also got um, your USB and AUX, downhill assist. Uh, rear diff lock is standard and obviously traction control, power and eco mode, six speed manual gearbox. Nice load just on the console with a 100 watt inverter. Now that's a, uh, a leather wrap finish as well. And then just in here, all our books and service history and owner's manual. Get across to the actual servicing itself. Find it. There we go. So first service there done at 10,000 Ks and not due till 20,100. So a uh, full service history with the vehicle as you can see and as you would expect from something that's only done 15,000 Ks. Um, so what we'll do, we'll turn this one off, we'll jump out and give you a final look over the vehicle now. Alrighty, so that is our Toyota Hilux SR5, uh, dual cab ute. I hope you enjoy the video. If you do have any further questions, please don't hesitate to give me a call. Um, but I look forward to doing business with yourself very soon. Cheers.